Welcome back to Farm and Hammer, everyone. I just finished filming the Wii Flip, Flip the Combine video, um, if you guys have seen that. Um, so that's why I'm in the same clothes here. I don't know if I've told you guys this or not in other videos, but um, not only do I love farming and animals on the farm, um, but wildlife is also extremely important to me. Uh, before college, I was gonna, I was gonna major in wildlife biology, and then when I actually got there, I ended up doing animal science. But originally, I was gonna do wildlife biology, and I was kind of hoping to eventually do be a conservationist or something. Anyway, obviously that did not happen. I majored in animal science, but wildlife has still always been um, a big priority for me. I love hunting. Um, I'm not a huge fisherman, but um, people in my family are. But yeah, native wildlife and habitat for them has always been um, something I've enjoyed. So yeah, one of the things, this is gonna be kind of strange. I don't even know if there's any videos on YouTube about these, but um, we have a number of older sheds and barns here on the farm. And uh, I know one of my uncles has had owls, like barn owls, have eggs um, and raise a group of barn owls in one of his old barns. Um, us personally, we've never actually seen any in our barns before. But uh, this year, we've had a rare occurrence where two of our barns have had a large bird um, lay eggs and actually hatch out some chicks. I don't know if that's what you call them, but we're gonna head in the barn. It's gonna be a little dark, but I'm gonna try to get a light out. Um, this barn here, this one only has one that survived. There were two eggs originally, only one actually hatched. So we're gonna take a look. This is the older, this is the older one. Um, and uh, we're gonna try not to get attacked. So once again, this is an old nasty barn. Um, we haven't owned it for a super long time. So we finally got around to trying to clean it all up. And uh, clearly we have not finished. And uh, I'm gonna turn my phone light on. You can probably hear that. That is the vulture chick. And he's pretty scary looking, but he's only a baby. Zoom in for you. Try to zoom in for you here. He's spreading his wings. <laughs> um, trying to let you see his face. They sound pretty scary at this age. Um, baby owls do the same exact noise. And uh, as you can see, he doesn't have feathers yet. But uh, He's about two weeks old. And uh, for being ugly, he's kind of cute. Um, so this is a uh, this is a baby turkey vulture. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here and quit bothering him. Um, obviously the sound is pretty creepy. Uh, if you walked in there in the dark, didn't know what was in there, you'd be pretty freaked out because it is a pretty terrifying noise. And as that thing gets older, his noise just gets louder. So anyway, so that is the first vulture chick, I guess we're gonna call it. And now we're gonna head to the other barn. That one is about two weeks old. The other barn, they were just hatched out this week. So they're a couple days old. Um, they still make noise, but these are a lot smaller. So guys, these two young chicks, um, they were actually born in this uh, this old abandoned barn here. I know I've showed you guys this at least once. And uh, the mother or father just flew out of here. I don't know which. For turkey vultures, I know both the mother and the father, um, they both sit on the eggs and they switch out. So um, I don't know which one's which, but they both hang around here. They both fly in and out. So. Here, they're already making noise. Get my light going here again. I 
And these, as you can tell, are pretty young. So these were just hatched out this week. They're about six inches tall. They're tiny little guys. And uh, there are only two eggs laid and both of them hatched. So um, from what I've read, it seems like that is common with turkey vultures. They normally lay one or two eggs. I'm assuming three is possible, but um, they normally only hatch out one or two, so. Anyway, these guys were, these guys hatched in all these old chair tops. And uh, let me get you one more close up here. So guys, the babies have finally calmed down. They're quiet now. I'm guessing they're asleep. Um, the mother is currently flying around. I know it's going to be hard to see. She normally lands and sits right there on the brush pile, but now she's flying around through those trees waiting on me to leave. When these were still eggs, we were very careful. We didn't want to come here a lot because we didn't want her popping off the nest, the eggs getting too cold, and the eggs dying. So, so we really haven't been up here a lot until after they've hatched. And now that they've hatched, we'll come up, I don't know, I may try to come up once a week um, just to see how they're growing. This is not a normal occurrence for us. We never see this and uh, I'm sure most of you have not seen videos or seen this in person either. So that being said, if you guys are interested in seeing more videos, I might do an update video once a week just on these little vultures here. Um, I'd like to get a game camera out here and show some footage of the mother or father actually feeding the babies and uh, maybe get some nighttime footage just to see what's actually going on behind the scenes. But yeah, like I said, this is not normal. I'm sure most of you have not seen this. I'm not sure exactly how she feeds them. I know she brings dead animals in here because it reeks up here. We found a couple huge dead snakes and things like that, I'm assuming they're a roadkill. But either way, she is coming in and feeding them. I'd like to get some footage of her feeding them, um, just things like that. So um, if you guys are interested, like I said, please leave a comment down below. Um, you'd like to see a short little update video of these every week and uh, these won't replace the normal farm vlogs but um, I think they would be interesting at least I find them interesting so um, if you could do that leave a comment down below that you'd want to see more and uh, yeah guys with that being said thank you for watching if you guys are interested I will see you in the next farm vlog or next vulture update video see you guys soon